Led Zeppelin for the first time, and I was I was inspired to play the drums. And decided that's what I was going to do. Just started playing. That's <laughs> really it. Kept going. I'm still doing it, and I'm not going to stop. always got me little instruments and stuff, and I like begged and begged to get violin lessons and stuff like that, but I just never kept up with it. But it was all about Bowie, Rebel Rebel. I heard that and I just pictured myself on the big like Firestone stage, like just playing some Bowie and I'm like, oh my god, and everyone's like cheering, so yeah, that's what happened. <laughs> that's what happened to me. jam nights at my house off of Crosby and they were like huge and epic and amazing. I swear to God. On Tuesday nights. On Tuesdays. Jam, yeah, jam night on Tuesdays. And Sam was like, he just like heard about it. I don't know. He was like really young. I mean, I lived I lived down the street and I, I somehow heard about it. I can't really remember, but I would just show up and I didn't even know who I was. I was like, who are these <laughs> cute little boys in my house? Yeah. It's like 18. <laughs> Yeah, and then like a year and a half later, we just started jamming. We didn't have a band name actually for like the first seven months of playing. We would just play shows as whatever. Yeah, we didn't have a band name. We were just shows. Yeah, and then we were the young ones. <laughs> the young ones. <laughs> and and then everyone's like, like, you're a, not that young though. Yeah, everyone kind of hated us for it somehow. <laughs> Time camp was like this book children's book and one day I was like digging through some old stuff at my parents house and I found Time Cat and I was like oh man this is like a cool cover I'm gonna take this home and read it or something and then I wrote one of the like our best songs like I wrote it like just the lyrics on one of the cover sheets that had like Time Cat in the middle so I was like oh, just name the band that oh